Hi, my name is Carla. I'm the director of the Cambridge Somerville WIC program. Um, I just made this session about uh, farmers market information to um, inform everyone how we're going to be doing distribution this year. So basically every year we'll, we get an incentive um, to give vouchers uh, to be used by our clients um, at the farmers market. So these are paper uh, vouchers. Um, so you would have to come in person to pick it up at the um, events that we're doing throughout the summer we decided to distribute at the at some of our uh, markets to make it easier so you come to get the the vouchers and you can use right there and then um so we do not have enough for all our week clients so we received um a certain allotted amount so that's why we do the events and whoever shows up will get it um first come first serve so hopefully we'll have for all the events so basically for each um uh client uh active in the program uh you will get 30 dollars worth of uh fruits and vegetables at the market we have the booklets they are um six um six uh it's like a check of five dollars each and um each active client will receive one booklet with thirty dollars six six checks of five dollars each at the markets they do not um do um return money or uh, give you a uh, change so if you let's say you're in a tent and you spend um six dollars i would recommend giving five dollar coupon and then pay one dollar out of pocket um and then if by any means you spend four dollars and fifty cents just make sure you use you uh, you know buy something else to do it to use the whole five dollars um so if you are a family with two kids and by any means one of your kids turn five you know like the day before of the event that you are participating unfortunately one only one of your kids will qualify that's what we call active in the program so you have to be um using your benefits your card has to be activated and everything has to be working so we know that it's hard for everyone to make at the market so you, if by any chance you have a friend that would like to go with you just make sure you give that friend um, your card and send them a text message authorizing that person to pick up for you so I can uh, check right there um, at the market uh, your phone number and your information, you know, um, put your name and you're authorizing this person to pick up the vouchers for you and a picture of your um, WIC card so we can check everything before handing them your um, farmer's market vouchers. You have until October 31st to use. So basically, if someone uh, got it for you and they're not going to be shopping that day uh, that, at that market, you can, she can bring it home uh, for you and you have until October 31st to use those vouchers. After that, they are expired and you cannot use it um, at the regular store. It's just for the uh, the markets around Massachusetts. So not necessarily you have to come to um, the ones around us if you live in the next door, um, you know, like the cities around us, but not necessarily Cambridge, Somerville, Watertown or Arlington, but you like, you know, to use, let's say the Malden or the Medford uh, farmer's market, you can't use it anywhere. Um, um, some markets might have um, a match program. So even though you get the WIC vouchers, um, you if you have SNAP, they'll give you extra money, you know, to be used at the market. So always ask. There is usually an um, administration tent and they can give you more information. Each mark is different. So we try to have all the information. So when you come, we'll, we'll give you um, uh, what is happening on that day and time. I will try to share my screen now so you can have, um, you can see the dates and times that we will be doing it. So basically we'll, we're gonna be distributing all this, um, six locations during uh, the times that the markets are happening so you can come to any of them you know um, if you cannot even though sometimes you live in Cambridge but this one is not good for you to make it you can always come to another one as uh, if you're available the other day in time um, 
so you can take a screenshot. We will be sending messages to um, our clients on the phone when the markets are happening, so you can come. Uh, most likely, if you belong to our Cambridge program, we'll be texting um, the message to the uh, to you with the Cambridge location. If you live in Somerville, we'll send you the Somerville location, but you can come to any of the events that we'll be doing throughout the summer. Um, yes, it is. Um, first come first serve for this event so like i said since we do not have enough for everyone so we hope that we have enough uh, coupons to last us to all these um dates and times but uh, if we happen to run out um then we'll stop distribution on that day um my guess is that uh, we will have enough for this date and then if we have any leftover we'll have a second distribution in august which will communicate once we finish um, all the events for the month of July. Um, yes, um, the, the question that we have always is sometimes people, because you guys are in the market shopping, you know, with the paper wick vouchers, you have your WIC card and um, you want to shop. Unfortunately, we don't have that flexibility. Um, so you still have to use your um, fruits and vegetables um, cash it, you, um, that you get on your card at the regular uh, food store and same vice versa. You can like, let's say you have some farm vouchers, paper vouchers, you cannot try to use at the store because they won't be accepting that. It's only um, at the farmer's market, but you can use throughout the whole state of Massachusetts. Uh, all right, since um, since we are here, I wanted to um, inform you guys to that as of August 1st, WIC is going, uh, we no longer have our um, waivers with, um, and most of our appointments will turn into in-person appointments uh, back into the offices. So you don't have to worry. You don't have to come, you know, and say, oh, my next appointment, I'll no, no, we will have communication. And it's like we we have people like that apply every year. So just as an example, if someone applying April this year, not necessarily they will have to come in August and do an in-person appointment. It's just after August 1st, your next appointment that we need measures or we need um, a, a reapplication, for example, we will be communicating with you that it has to be done in person. So just um, making a note here, since you guys are going to be coming for farmer's market, in case um, you have an appointment coming up, and you cannot make on the day and time that is set up for any given reason. You can always come earlier and we can try to do your paperwork and measure kids or adults in the family that will need measures to have everything set. So when the, then, you know, we have to call to finish your nutrition appointment, we can have all the information in case. But um, I believe since um, the beginning of this month, yeah, at the end of May, beginning of June, we nutritionists already start setting up these appointments in August, already giving all the information to everyone to make sure it was booked in a day and time that um, availability was okay to come into the office. But just mentioning, since you guys are uh, most likely, uh, if you did not come and receive in this video, so you can have the information for um, your reference. Our email address is WIC, W I C, at ch alliance with aboil.org in case you have any more questions. And uh, our office number is 617 575 5330 for any information too, if you guys still have questions. But hopefully, uh, with that said, main idea is. You have the dates and times that is, yeah, the events are, are happening. You have, um, you, you know that you can come to any of these events. You will be text message, you know, close to the date, another reminder. And you, in case you can't come, you can always send someone with a picture of your card and a message so we can check information and provide the vouchers to anyone that is helping you um, get this benefit. So. 
Thank you very much. And I'll be disconnecting now, but feel free to reach out to us if you have any other questions. Bye.